Hello, my dogs. It's that I'm waiting patiently for 1,000 subscribers because I actually took the time out of my day to spend 2.30 on Outlast here. And we are back playing some more Detroit Become Human while I wait for the inevitability of being scared to shit because I'm really scared of playing Outlast. But listen, I held up my end of the bargain, people. Help me get to 1,000 subscribers and it will be a reality. I will play Outlast. But for now... We're back with part three of Detroit Become Human. Hello, Gacha Tells. Good to see you, man. Let's just not wait. Did you find the game too easy? Excuse me, I'm monologuing here. My God, the nerve of that woman. Am I right, everyone? I'm literally just introducing everything, saying I hope you all have a good day and whatnot. She fucking pipes up like that. How rude. Yo, what's this? Oh, hello, Zach. Um, I'm just playing Detroit Become Human. Um, this is a completely blind playthrough. Like, I have never played this game before properly. I'm just trying to play through the game and just have a fun time while trying to get the good ending. I don't know what I'm doing. I am just crossing my fingers, hoping that pressing these buttons in a certain way is how I win. And I'm getting a bunch of messages right now because I've told all my friends that um, I bought Outlast. Because I really want to hit 1,000 subscribers before the end of 2022. And I feel like if I play Outlast for you guys and whatnot, and you guys can laugh and see me get tortured by absolute fear. Nice, I'm from Michigan. <laughs> How funny. Detroit Become Human. This is from your own town. Detroit Become Human is a game about robots and androids. And you follow three androids throughout the game doing their stuff. And it's kind of like... You remember how there was the thing with racism about how black people, people of colour, they didn't have rights for the longest time? It was really awful and whatnot. Then eventually they fought. Same with women's rights, you know, things like that. And uh, basically it's just proving that the androids in Detroit become human and can actually be human, hence the title. There's nothing human about Detroit. It sucks here. Well, yeah, I imagine it rather does suck considering it's fucking terrible in the world at the moment. You know, you've got all the stuff going on with Russia, Ukraine, you know, you've got... The cost of living crisis over here in the UK. I'm not sure how badly it's affecting America, but I imagine it's having somewhat of an effect. Just know it's not exactly the most pleasant thing in the world. Oh, I hope whatever turm turmoils and troubles you go through, you're okay. And I remember, I forget his name. He told me to do this last time. Activate that. I remember last time we spoke to the woman over here, Amanda, I think her name was. Thanks, man, you too. No problem. Glad you stopped by. But yeah, honestly, I'm going to have a worse time when it comes to playing Outlast. It's because my brother's been hyping the game up for years for me, like saying how fucking scary it is, how it's a game that's terrifying to him and whatnot. So naturally, I've just been pretty scared. Yes, hello, hello Amanda. Amanda. This is the woman Connor, I was speaking to before to my stream you. and everything. I had to end it. Congratulations, Connor. Thank Finding you. Finding that deviant was far from easy. Oh yeah, it was. And the way you interrogated. A lot more of those androids clever. are going to be what they call You've deviants. It basically means they go Connor. against their programming. Thank you, Amanda. Connor, for We've example, is an android. To transfer it to us for further study. And they keep saying, we make sure he becomes a deviant happened. as well. Make sure he becomes more and more unstable. The interrogation seemed challenging. Well, yeah, it was, you know, trying to not get the guy to commit seppuku. It showed signs of PTSD after being abused by a Yes, toner. it did have PTSD. You saw the cigarette burns on his arms. Replaced so. by new instructions. Yeah. This... Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the deviancy case. What do you make of him? Intriguing. I think he's irritable. What intriguing? And socially challenged. Points for honesty. But I also think he used to be a good detective. Yeah, he used to be a good one, yeah. He's an intriguing character. Unfortunately, we have no choice but to work with him. Yeah, unfortunately, you, you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh... Friendly. I will try to establish a friendly relationship. You have to prove that we're human. If I can get him to Even trust if it's me, negative, it I don't care. 
We are not. We are more than just an android. We are a more person, and more Donna. Android show signs of deviancy. And that's a good there thing, according to the others. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. Yes, of course, but sometimes, you know, that's a good thing. Cyber life considering all the segregation and shit they're going through at the moment. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Yes. I guess we shall stop them, Hurry, quote unquote. Connor. There's little time. I mean, we've got plenty of time, unfortunately for you, love. We have a pause button, you don't. Oh, what's going on? His thing was acting up, his little tracker in his head. Oh yeah, no, I remember this where it was last time. The question is though, did we save um, Carl? Did he not die? Because I had to play through like five missions before because I made the wrong choice. And let's no hope that he's alive. Prior authorization. authorization required. Oh, so we have to talk to the... Um, people up front over here. Yeah, I forgot I needed to do that. Can I help you? Thing. I'm yes. here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. And just like that, they just connect within two seconds. Imagine how scary that's going to be Lieutenant in the real Anderson world. Hasn't arrived yet, like if but that happens. Wait at his desk. Authorization. And I guess she just knows then if somebody's been granted authentication or not. That's going to be scary to think about. Right, there should be a magazine or a paper somewhere. Nope, that's really DET read. Should be a. Right, is that it? L1. No, that's Peterson. Um, I know where the, ch the his desk is, but the question is, where's the magazine or something you were reading? Yeah, it's Lieutenant Anderson's desk. So I suppose we just have to wait. Excuse me. Or ask this Do you person. know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. So hopefully that like won't be long. see him before noon. Thanks. Wait for Lieutenant Anderson. I guess we have no choice but to sit down. There we go. Take a seat, Connor. You deserve it, mate. Explore the new office. Fine by me. That was the shortest sit down, but I guess we all need him. Me, for example, I'm very bad with my legs. My legs suck. Oh, that's uh, is that music? A phone. Oh, Knights of the Black Death, a dark heavy metal release date in 2021. Oh, I don't know why we haven't heard of that yet. Alright, we need to find it. There's a magazine or something. Detroit Today. Yes. Yes. Okay, right. There's nothing about a famous artist dying, which means I guess we're on track. But let's analyse this. I know about this game. I know you have to try and analyse as much every single piece of info that you can. First things first. Jimmy's Bar. Um, wood. First, I don't know how to pronounce that kind of wood, but it's wood. Detroit police dismantle a network of red ice dealers. If you notice, red ice was the stuff that I forget uh, Todd had um, when he was with... I forget a name. Who's the little girl's name? With Kara. Well, y you know who I mean, yes. Queen Lieutenant think Lieutenant Hank Anderson was among the most decorated detectives in DPD's recent history. So that's why he has so much um, notoriety then, because he helped bust a lot of that. That's just hair, I'm guessing. Canine hairs from a Saint Bernard. Aww. If it's Kuja, I'm gonna be scared. Oh look, it's Glenn's hat before he got his head bashed in. Well, not really. 90% cotton and 10% polyester. We don't bleed the same colour. Anti-android slur. You know, that's... As sad as this is going to say, that's actually a pretty funny... Or not funny, clever slogan. Like, for playing words, we don't bleed the same because they literally do not bleed the same. Sad. Hello, Caitlin Howell. How are you doing? Multi-department unit responsible for the Red Ice Network dismantle... Of 2028. Oh, yeah. Caitlin, if you saw in my YouTube shorts, I bought Outlast. I'm just waiting to hit 1k subs to do it. Donuts. 
calories 452 saturated fatty acids 13 grams cholesterol 19 milligrams carbohydrates 51 grams okay of course there'd be a donut here that's a tree that's a japanese maple um or a flower that's wilted working on my telekinesis again i've tried to make a soda can raw oh excuse me i wish you the best of luck coffee cup cold coffee traces of caffeine no i did not Okay, so we got Lieutenant Anderson was a decorated officer. There it's he good is. to see you again, Lieutenant. Yep, good oh, to see you. Jesus. So. Hank! In my office. Oh, for God's sake. Explores the office. Go see the deviant. Listen to breathing. But I guess we'll check everything out that we can. I love cold coffee. Um, I'm just not a fan of coffee in general because I hate milk. Alright, well, no, 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 that's the thing. That's the paper we need to read. Or another one. There is no mention, literally no mention of a, um, of the uh, Carl. Remember the old guy we saved last time? There's no mention of him, of him dead. So hopefully when Tyler, think of Ty, I'm trying to think of the guy's name who we were with last time who were helping us. I just look at them there, just sitting idly on the wall. That's creepy. Hopefully when he comes here, my choices and everything will be alright. So, um, how's your Friday been then, Caitlin? You excited for Halloween this Monday? I know I am. Oh, here we go. I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Fair enough. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of I investigation. Of Bullshit! Oh. The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold in the bag. Wow. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. Yeah, I'm just hoping my name. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. Uh, It'll act as your partner. No name. fucking way! I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic. Pr you can hear us, Mr. Krabs. You can hear Mr. Krabs coming out there for a second, because. Um, Clancy Brown, the voice actor of Hank, also does the voice of Mr. Krabs. So if you listen closely, you can hear his, the Mr. Krabs in his voice. Frank, Hank, you are seriously starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Yeah. Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that. So I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. <laughs> this conversation is over. Jesus. Yep. Hank, Mander's combat. Jeffrey, I love Mander's combat. Why are you yeah. doing this to me? You know how much I these fucking things? Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. Dang. I got heated <sighs> fast. I mean, it was. Um... Anderson. I wonder whether Lieutenant Anderson is really the best person for this investigation. Hey, I don't need a machine to tell me how to handle my men, okay? Wow, so get the dick. fuck out of my office. What a dick. Have a nice day, Captain. Yeah, at least you could keep your composure. Whack the guy across the face. Grab the fucking chair, tear off a leg, and just beam, bam, 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 bam. Beat him across the face with it. Alright, yeah, let's go check on Hank, see how our man's doing. Come on, bro. We all have rough days, let's be honest. Let's be understanding. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience, Lieutenant. I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about It'd that. It'd be done then, yeah. Uh, partners, positive. In any case, I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you. I'm sure we'll make a great team. Yeah, let's just keep trying to make it feel better. Pot. A desk. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. Right, yep, thank you. Right. I'm trying to not pick the desk one because, like, I don't want to piss them off even more. That's what I don't want to do. I have to meet, uh, uh, maintain a uh, nice ish relationship with Hank, though. That's one thing he said last time. Ugh. It's a good excuse me. Do not bring up basketball. Because he likes basketball. That's what he said last time. Let's do the dog. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? Well, he's all... The dog hair's on your chair. Stress. I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? 
I just wanted to get to know you. Sumo. There you go. Call him Sumo. That's a very nice name. I like that. That's very cute. Lab report says they cut right, what about... Music. Do you listen to Knights of the Black Death? I really like that music. It's full of energy. Yeah, you I listen do too. To heavy great metal? Yeah, heavy metal's a great well, genre, man. Honestly, I don't like really legit. listen to music as such. But I'd like to. Uh, what about anti-androids? A lot of people don't appreciate having androids around. I was wondering, is there any reason in particular you despise me? Oh yeah, get to know. I'll be down yeah. to listen to listen to it myself. There is one. What's the reason? Oh fucking hell, that wasn't good. That was a good shit. I shouldn't have said that. Damn it. Oh, whatever. What about Fowler? Have you known Captain Fowler for long? Yeah. Too Damn, long. Not bad. Let's just hope, hopefully, the positives can outweigh the negative. I was wondering. There we go. Yeah. Do you always arrive at the office at this time? I arrive when I arrive. Stop busting my balls, okay? Oh, that was bad. Shit. Dang it. All right, no, I'll leave them be. I'll start working. If you then. have any files on deviants, yeah, I'd so like we need to, to start handling the deviant case essentially. Terminals on your desk. Knock yourself out. By the way, uh, Caitlin, do you have a favorite horror film or horror film genre, like film type thing? Yeah, but don't worry about the basketball. Like, do you have a favorite horror film? Right, Missing Owl series. Case preference disappearance. Agency name Detroit. Blah blah blah. Victim, Gordon Lopez, reporting officer, but case, case assigned to Lieutenant Anderson, case status open, involving android. That's a hard one, there's lots. Well, how about you list a couple? Alright, the plaintiff reports that he left his android at home. As he... Hi Joshua, how you doing, man? It's good to have you. Not sure if you saw up on my YouTube short, but I bought Outlast, so I'm just waiting to hit 1k till I play it. Yeah. When he returned, the android was nowhere to be found. No trace of a break into the apartment. The android may have left home without being ordered to. What's the Halloween special going to be? Alright, the gremlins and Night of the Living Dead. To be honest, Joshua, I don't think I was going to have one this year. I, I'm trying to think. It's just because I had plans with my parents and whatnot to watch, like, binge Halloween films. I'd probably make, like, a uh, video saying Happy Halloween and other stuff. Just trying to think because, you know, one time I'd just like to have spend time with my family because I've been looking forward to watching some horror films with them or binging it. It's going to be a lot of fun. So I'm just going to try and chill. Christmas, I'd like to do some stuff, though. Or, or maybe before I start watching the films, I could play the Left 4 Dead um, Halloween map I've got. That could be fun. Yeah, probably that. Suspect. Um, case attack. Uh-oh. This is Charles Bell. Blah, blah, blah. Yep. The plaintiff claims to have been attacked by the android model. Working as a waiter in the Fast Coney Dogs restaurant chain situated at 842 Chamberlain Avenue. The plaintiff... Can Ba -ba -ba. The plaintiff claims the android lunged at him unexpectedly and attempted to strangle the man before leaving the scene. The android remains at large. Suspect, Sarah Cornwall. Um, yep. The plaintiff claims to have been attacked by her android, an AP-700, blah, blah, blah. The android also trashed several rooms of the house before taking flight. Jesus. All right. Floyd Mills. The plaintiff, the manager of the Eden Club, reported the unexplained disappearance of a sex android model. The android disappeared after accompanying to a custom a customer to his house and never returned to the club. I mean, that place is probably all kinds of nasty. I don't blame her, personally. Oof, you literally. At least we scanned it all. Files. Damn, that's a First lot of files. Dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread They're All in the, the same country. area, all going so quickly. An AX-400 is reported to have murdered a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. True. That's, uh, understanding. I understand you're facing personal Let's hope this is the right one. But you need to move past them, and... Hey, don't talk to me like you know me. Uh -oh, I'm don't. not your friend, and I don't need your advice, okay? All right, okay, right. I'm trying to think how to handle him. Determined, then. Let's just be determined about it, yeah. 
I've been assigned this mission, Lieutenant. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Oh, that was wrong. That was you was wrong. Up to me, I threw the lot well, of you in a me. dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. Well, that was the wrong answer, clearly. Nasty. Uh, Lieutenant? It's going to be hard to appease him, you. then, clearly. I have some information on the AX400 that killed the guy last night. It's been sighted in the Raven of the Calm down, Eugene. I'm on it. That's your name Just now. You're not called Hank. You are Eugene H. Krabs. You somehow gained the ability to breathe, water, uh, breathe air instead of water. Maybe you capture your abilities from the movie. Who the fuck knows? But regardless, it says, it says negative. Okay. Okay, well, we got a trophy. That's whatever, ultimately. Let's just hope we can make it up to Hank later and try and redeem ourselves. Alright, I think up next... Actually, it's Alice, isn't it? Alice, that's the little girl we were with, right? Gotta be her. Alice and Kara. And Kara. Fucking our wrong character. I'm not good with names. I like Gremlins and... Uh, yep, Night Living Dead. Alright, we should be with Kara now. Right? Yes! That was incredibly forced, but yes! Alright, she's okay. She's trusted, that's what we need. We need to keep making her happy. Oh, hold on, I need to check something on my Discord. Uh, hold on, I need to... Um, thing. I need to just check the messages because I've been sent constantly about the streaming of the stuff. I forgot what the guy's name was, the one that let them in. I'm trying to think too. Alright, what's going on in the news today then? Alright, Cyber Wildlife. First Android Zoo opens. US life expectancy now 91. Jesus. Ooh. Canada is still Android free. Wow. Dang. Cyber wildlife. Yes, yeah, so they're making thing. So I wonder what else there is we need to keep checking on. Revive the fire. Can we check on Alice first? Uh, how do I... I'm pressing the wrong thing. Check. Can I... Alright. Come on. There we go. My mom wants me to participate in a dolphin encounter next time we go to Disney World. I've never been to Disney World before. I'd like to go though. Alright, we need something to thing, yeah. Find some wood. Oh no, we just picked that up before, my bad. Nope, put it down. I thought it was something I put it down, Kara, Kara. There we go, right. There we go, let's take the wood and just pop it back on. It keeps a good amount of that stuff, but then again, considering we're in a house, I imagine it's a bit dilapidated. Um, getting stuff to burn the fire constantly, it won't be too hard. Wait until Alice wakes up. Alright, uh, yes, we'll leave her be then. Let's go check in in the kitchen, because I saw there's a prompt in here. 
examine. What have we got here? It's a deer. Yep, RA9, RA9. This is all the stuff he was writing last time. What have we got here? Keeping our girl happy. We have... Watch a bird. And so I'm guessing this is going to be like, you can take these items, steal these items, but... I'm going to leave them be. I don't want to touch anything right now. Simply for the fact that they could be his and I could probably piss them off and I could probably get Alice in danger. And that's what I don't want. So I guess we just have to wait. Oh, there's a mirror there. How long's that mirror been there? How long's this been here for? Jeez. Maybe it's only because now they give me the prompt, so... Oh, cutscene. Oh yeah, this is where we're going to look at ourselves, surely. Probably a long time. Change your appearance, find some new... Oh, we're going to have a makeover. Alright then, Kara, let's get you into some new clothes. Question is, where the hell is he going to have clothes at? This guy, where is he anyway? I just checked the wardrobe. Probably a long time. Right. Alright, let's put it on. Are we putting it on or what are we? Oh, don't what are you doing with the gun? Are we gonna lose that gun? I have a feeling we're going to. Well at least the camera pans away so I don't have to censor anything. Then again, I don't even know if all um, animatron not animatronics, fucking hell, all androids are made anatomically correct and if it's not just the sex bots. Is it going to be nearby? Find the gun. Change appearance. Found human clothes. Cut hair. Alright, can I can I pick? Yeah, I'm taking the gun back just in case. Yep. You want to keep yourself strapped with that. You never know when I might need the gun. So then, because it says on the run, what do you think this is going to be about, Caitlin? Wait, what do you think is going to go down in this episode? Or well, I guess this part, this chapter. I I I really. Don't know. Alright, so we can cut in the mirror here. There we go, right. Get up. Get out the snippers. There you go. I mean, our hair is already pretty short as it is. Alright. There we go. Don't cut yourself. Not sure. Probably some chaos like it usually is. Maybe something intense. Possibly. Well, there we go. We go for a shorter haircut, but we don't look like a Karen. Like a buddy. We kind of look like Jane from... Oh, we could do our hair. Okay, right. Alright, well, if we're going badass then... Should I go white, black, or... Ah... Uh... The horror fan in me is telling me to go blonde because of Tiffany from Chucky. The emo in me is telling me to say black, but the anime nerd in me is telling me to say white. So, which one do we do? Do we do, do we do color me blondie? Do we do white like Konoko, or do we just go black like Kuroka? I don't know, man. What do we do? I have to think. I don't know why I never really am pissed off too much about hair color, but thing. Alright, you know what? Fine, I'll have a think. Let's go white, screw it. Let's see how the colour looks like. Oh, you can just change it like that. Oh, we can cycle through them. Ah, okay. I thought it was going to be like a, once you pick it, you have it forever. Okay, let's have a look through all the colours then. Okay. Yeah, that was brown. Alright, what's blonde looking like? Let's see blonde. Yeah. I feel like we got to do blonde. we got to do blonde. Simply for the fact that she reminds me of Jane from The Walking Dead. Oh, we're tearing it out, are we? Yeah, we are. Oh, shit. Oh. Dang. And it just heals like that. Well, there you go. There's, there goes the tracker. That's two then. So I wonder when Connor's going to lose his. Marcus has lost his. Kara's lost her. Wait. 
Oh, he's going to be in this now, isn't he? Yeah, I can look. I can already see the body. I can see the hands. Yeah, you can see the hands there. Is he going to jump scare me? Wait, whoa, what the fuck? He's got a corpse in here. Okay, no, 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 no. I just thought that was... I thought that was just, like, him laying in the bathtub. I didn't know that... Uh-oh. Oh, God. That's all for now. Oh, it's Hank. Oh, this ain't good. We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody oh, saw Oh, do you think they're looking okay, for him? Let me know if they probably are. Up. Yeah. What are you going to do with that? I have no idea. It took the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. It was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Yes, they do. do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. All right, well, that still doesn't tell us where it went. It didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. True. Maybe. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, what the f Oh, Jesus, what are you doing? Ralph found this to feed the little girl. Okay, he means well, but that's just... <laughs> Good for her. A present. Whoa, okay, Ralph. Yeah, that's the same Ralph. Calm down. <laughs> Ralph okay. Cook. It's your presentation. Just like it's do. your presentation that's wrong, mate. It's your presentation. Like <laughs> come. Come and sit down. Uh, I feel like we should sit down just to appease them. Let's just. Yeah. Okay, we'll sit down, but we'll just kind of. You can tell he's a little that's on better. edge. He means well. Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. Wouldn't be polite for her to refuse. He Would clearly it? doesn't mean anything hard, too harmful. <laughs> Great. 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 <laughs> Succulent, you'll see. Oh jeez, yeah, she's she's a, she's afraid. <laughs> Father, mother, little girl. Please, Cara. I don't want to eat that. What did she say? I say. Let's tell the truth, yeah? She don't, the girl doesn't want to eat it. She said she doesn't want to eat it. Well, maybe it's not good enough. It went down, but Christ. Maybe she's used to better things. But Ralph did this for her, so she's going to eat! Oh, shit. Oh, God. Alright, let's get him out of here. Go ahead. Eat. No. Oh, fucking Christ, calm down. Jesus. He ain't abusive, he's just a little little bit loopy. Is there, is there a scapegoat out of this? Let's ask about the corpse. Yeah, fuck it, let's do it. I saw the body upstairs. You killed that human, didn't you? No. Yeah, you did. No, he was like that when Ralph found him. Did he? Let's... let's insist about it you killed that man ralph there's no point in lying you hate humans but you're just like them you're a murderer ralph didn't mean any harm what's going on with the man he's no can we calm him down it's just a... okay all right okay ralph can't control his anger no he has some issues clearly he's, he's all broken comes. ralph doesn't know what he's doing he becomes stupid. He's the self-aware of it. Wait. I'm sorry. It's fine. He just wanted to be your friend. Yeah, I can tell he's wrong, like somewhat sort with him, but he doesn't then let's seem. Go. Oh fuck. Anybody home? Oh fuck. That's them. There's blue blood on the fence. Oh god. Oh and god. Another android was here.
Oh god, now we're with Connor. That's cool how it's two, we can take control of two people. Now what the hell are we going to do now? Let's just... Let's go in the same way we normally do. Let's open it. Where's Ralph out? There he is. Let's analyze him. We scan? Yes, we can. Let's do it. Right. What's going on with his ID tracker? It's probability of self-destruction moderate. Uh oh. That's the thing, yeah, androids self-destruct when they get too stressed. Gardener. He was a gardener. He's reported missing. Burn mark. Jesus. So he got burned. AX400. I'm looking for an AX400. Have you seen it? Ralph seen nobody. There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Ralph scratched himself coming through. That's Ralph's bud. Uh, that's... Are there any other androids here? Other androids? No. Ralph is alone. Okay. I don't buy a card of that. Don't be afraid. True. I'm not gonna hurt you. Right, so now we just have to have a look around then. Perfect tool to cut a wire fence. Androids don't need heat. She scratched her arm on the fence. Yeah, she did. RE9! It's the same thing he saw last time in the other house, if you remember. Well, look at his stress go all the way up when I go to the thing there. Oh. Yep, food androids don't eat, yeah. Gotta be under the stairs, surely. Connor, what the hell are you doing in there? Calm Come down, Mr. Krabs. Is anyone upstairs? No. Find Nobody. the. I know he's telling the truth. Yeah, there's so there's there's some body up there, but it's not. Stress level can't go too high. How do we de stress him? This is crazy. Whoa. Oh, Christ. There we go. Yep, yep, yep. Whoa. Uh oh. Uh oh. Connor, what's going on? It's here. Call it in. Whoa, well, shit. Yep, we're on the run. Which way did it go? That way. They're headed for the train station. Oh, Jesus Christ, yeah. They're over oh. there! 
Oh, Jesus Christ, yeah. Here we go, here we go. Don't shoot, we need it alive. Yeah, don't shoot. Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus. They gotta go, man. I don't want any of them to die. Oh, fuck. That's insane. We gotta go. Circle. Alright, fourth match of time. Circle. Okay. X. Max X. Go, go, go. Oh. Hey, where are you going? I can't let them get away. They won't. And never make it to the other side. I can't take that chance. Dang, you oh. will get yourself killed. Do not oh my god, no. I, I don't want to risk this. I'm all the way in. Do I have call to chase after them or what? Connor, that's an order. Alright, fine, let's let him go. Yeah, software instability went off. Hank's friendship went off. Okay, that's probably a good thing I did that. Yeah, let's leave him. X, okay. Okay, mash it, mash it, mash it. Whoa, shit. Circle! Come on, there you go. Alice, come on. Come on, love, you'll be alright. Go, 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 go. Get it, get it, get it, okay. Whew, we made it. We escaped. Okay, we did it. Are you okay? Yep, she's okay. That was scary. It's okay. Give her, yeah, there you go. Come here. You're gonna be okay. Don't worry. You ain't gonna die on my watch. Alice for life. Bro, my stress level. Yeah, same here. If I'd have messed any of those prompts up, we would have gone down. There we go. Run, Kara, run. That's literally it. That's a reference. Wrong for us. Oh, we're going to be with Marcus now because remember, it goes Connor, Ke Connor, Kara, Marcus. That's how it goes. So Marcus is next. It's because the mission. Several sources report that Cytolite. What's this mission Just called? Detroit oh, police. steady, steady on. Jericho. It's with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have been tested for several years now, this would be the first case of an android. Yep, there he is. We contacted Cytolite for comment. Fish Gotto, happy, happy early Halloween. Yep. Oh. Oh, that's who we have to find them. Okay. Whoa. So what are you doing for Halloween? I'm going to be spending some time with my family and, um... Yeah, spending time with my family and watching some horror films. They missed her. Can you spare some change? I can't. I don't have any money. I would if I could. Hold on to to decipher. They find the symbol. There it is. Okay, right. For me, just giving out candy, listening to Halloween music. That's a good time, though. As long as you're happy for Mama will talk the first Halloween with me. Nice. Not surprised. Yeah. Yeah. I 
know. It's crazy, right? Sure. Right, okay, what's going on today? Let's see. When a machine causes panic in Camden. Resistance. Yep. Yep, here we go. I consider playing some horror games. I want to as well. Literally, I downloaded Outlast and I'm waiting to hit 1,000 subscribers so I can play it on the live stream. Yep, there we go. So, yep, the news went out. At least they made it out. And we listened to what Hank said. I'm going to be trick-or-treating. That's cool. What are you going to be dressing up as? We're supposed to go down this one. There we go. Okay, yeah, I was struggling for a second. That's being weird. Down, down, down we go. Down the escalator. Down, down, down we go. To hopefully not die a gruesome death. There we go. I really want to play... Eyes. Oh, it's a really obscure horror game. I don't recommend it. An inkling from Splatoon. How creative. I like that. Okay, find the next graffiti. There is a graffiti over there. But most importantly, there is an alternate choice, which means you know I have to pick it. Talk to the android. Do you know where Jericho is? Yes, do you know where Jericho is? I guess not over here then. Right. I'm going as one of my characters, Aquarius. Alright, find the symbol. There's one. Alright, let's analyze it. Yep. Resident Evil Village DLC. That's not out yet, is it? I don't think it is. I'm a Sagittarius. Where's the other symbol at then? There it is. Sorry, it's, I was blind. There it is. Right, come on. And there we go. The clue's been updated. Oh, the trail to the next repeater. See, there's somebody just there. I'm just periodically checking so we can cross the road. Dang. It's real sad seeing all the people just like this. But I'm still just checking everything just in case if there's some kind of small minute detail that I'm missing over here. I don't think there is though. I think I'm just wasting my time. But I'm just exploring. I am a um, Aquarius. That's what I am. I'm, yeah, also Aquarius. February 2nd, that's uh, Aquarius. I tell you what, though, Caitlin, I had a fucking horrible night. Uh, like, last night, or, yeah, last night. I didn't fall to sleep today till 3 a.m., which coincidentally was the devil's hour because of uh, an insomnia episode. Well, not only that, but um, I was... Um, when I fell asleep, I only slept for three hours and I woke up with a horrific nightmare. That nightmare was so vivid and so weird that I'm probably going to have to make a story about it. Or I can make a story about it. Been around a scorpion before. The trauma is real. They were just as they were described. Wow, there is so much stuff over here. I went to bed around 3 a.m. last night. I wanted to sleep earlier, I just could not fall asleep. You ever have those moments where no matter how hard you try, you just can't sleep? Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm dealing with. I have to find the symbols in the building. Oh, there's one. Right. Okay. And there's two. That was easy. So there's a buildings with robots on it then. Right. Still just casually hugging every single building, trying to find... Yeah, mostly because of my pillows, I have to keep flopping them. I like them squishy, not flat. Fair. Yeah. 
I like how people cross over the green. It's like just all these other pieces of road just don't exist. That's pretty funny. But of course, out of all the things in the future, there is still going to be traffic. If only we had a flying Nimbus cloud. Unfortunately, we don't live in Dragon Ball. No context in that. Yeah, of course, but sometimes the best things don't have context. Right, it's not in there. It's got to be across the road then, surely. Ignoring the car. Crossy, crossy road. I right, we check down there, surely. Or if we try checking again. Yeah, so, yeah, we're looking for a simple robot. Dang. I don't even know where to look. Oh, well. Okay, so, like, he does an animation when we're too far out, then. So, it's not back here, then. Hey, look, bagel. Oh, yeah, I can see it. The designs of these cars, though, are freaking weird. I'll say that. There's a lot of graffiti over here, so my gut's telling me to try checking over here. See where it could be. Nope, it's not past that point. Oh, I'm wrong. Alright, so I'll have to cross again. Oh, don't bash into me, please. Thank you. There we go. We found it. Okay. There's one. That was easy. Yep, that one's been analysed. There's going to be some more. Yep, there's another one. Obstructed symbol. There's one there. You asked me, I just called a guy. Ah, okay. Right. Can we... Alright, we have to crouch. Oh yeah, this conveniently is open. There we go, just crawl on underneath. There we go. I don't really like discussing that stuff on live stream though, Caitlin, simply for the fact that I like to keep my live streams positive and whatnot. And there's the last symbol. Oh, can I? I meant to. There we go. We just keep coming back to this place. Yeah, we do. Yeah, this is the same place. There's the thing. Follow the trail to Jericho. I wonder what this could mean, though, honestly. Besides it being like some kind of uprising. At first, the one part of the chip looked like a face, yeah. Oh, we have to move this, alright. There we go, there we go, there we go. Put you back into it, Marcus. GG. And climb it. Oh, boing. There we go, and boing. Good strength. And there are the other two we need. Strong boy. Literally a strong boy. Alright. Actually, no, that's the first one. Right, there's another one. We already got that one, then. Right, where's the next symbol we're missing? Parkour, literally. Where's the next... Oh, there's the next symbol. Look at that, that's all hidden. Thanks. I'm the only one left. Yeah, literally, unfortunately. It's sad as well, because I like live stream, but I'm like, what's the point if it's just to barely anyone? Not saying that you don't count for anything, by the way, Caitlin. Alright, can we jump across? Reconstructs. Ah. Let's do it the cool way! Let's do it the cool way, come on. There we go. Nailed it. Haha. -ha. That 
That is just how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. My man's a poor called king. Right. Uh, boing, there we go. Nailed it. Alright, there's Jericho symbols up there on the Sparkle City. You can already see it. Right. Alright, there's one. I can already see the second one. And there's the third one. That was easy. Okay. We have to go inside a building somewhere then. It's, yeah, they're just finished. They're not finished construction. They're actually pre-construction. Okay. That's gonna flop and fall. Oh wait, no, I was right. Yeah, let's do that. Let's be an absolute legend. Yeah. I do parkour, bitches. Boink. There we go. Bro, this guy should be in dying light. He fit right in with Crane and Aiden and everyone else. For real though, get Marcus in the next Dying Light game. Make it happen. Uh, I'm trying to think of the guys who make it. Same people who do Dying Island. Right, it's the graffiti. That's right, over here. There's the first one. Yeah, look at that. That's very, very sneaky. I recognize the shape of the middle. Okay, there we go. I like how they're hidden in creative ways, that's pretty cool. Alright, mash it, mash it, mash it in the bit, even though it's a pretty obnoxious show that I've never got why people are interested in. Alright, L2. There we go. Jericho, it's the ship. It's a ship. Who would have guessed? It's a beaten up ship. Well, damn, do you think she still runs? Let's climb my ass on board and find out. Oh, never mind. Oh my god. So much for that planned. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So, well, now what? Guess we have to take the scenic route. Right, let's let's boing our way up. Come on, nail the jump. There we go. I knew what was going to happen and got scared. Yep. I was just laughing because I was like, "Let's climb our ass on board," and it's like, "Alas, that is not simple." And it just fucking like, just breaks apart instantly. Speaking of break apart, I don't know how structurally sound this is. Is this just gonna come apart while I'm walking as well? Fine. Oh, that sound of creaky metal. Looks like this this thing hasn't run in a while. There we go. Oh, don't. Oh, ah, ah, no, 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 no. I won't do that. Sorry, Kalen. <laughs> I was tempted, but I'm not going to be that jerk and force my camera to look down. Don't worry. Quite a few feelings is going to break again. Oh, we have to land in the water. Y you, you only live once. Oh, wow, that's, wow, that's dramatic. That was lame. Okay, well, we made it. Straight in the water. Oh, we're okay. Lost our coat, though. There we go. James Bond vibes. Literally, <laughs> just drop down with, like, no fucking facial expression. Right. Marcus, let's get in the Jericho. Come on, man. I never would have guessed it was a ship, though. That's pretty cool. 
Are there going to be other androids on here too? That's my working theory that there's going to be other people here. All of androids and shit. What's in there? Oh, a torch. Don't mind if I do. He's brave as hell for that. I'm scared for him, bro. Yeah, you and me both, Caitlin. You and me both. So we'll keep periodically scanning just in case there's something we're going to miss. And I guess we can't clear the debris out of there. Explore the boat, yep. Alright, let's let's open can we open this up? We can't remove that thing I'm guessing on it. Nope. We'll check all the doors, one of these bound has gotta gotta work, right? Yeah, that opens up, okay. But before we explore in that one, let's try this one. Do you open? No, you don't. Okay, so this was the right door. All along, essentially. Alright, this is a bedroom, clearly, for something. Is there anything on the bed? Under the bed? Prison style? Nah, nothing. Oh, there it is. RA9. RA9. They keep, they keep doing it, man. Why did they, what does RA9 mean? I suppose we'll figure it out sometime, but still, that's getting me, man. I don't know what it could mean. Caitlin, what do you think RA9 is? Oh, fucking... Okay, hello, Chief. Good to see you doing fine. Oh, that's what I want to know. Do you think that was a normal girl or an android? But oh my god, they were out quick. I didn't know I was already playing more. Oh. Jesus, this place is coming apart, literally. And it is old as hell, rust into crap. Is she going to be in here? In this place, there's something. I've been hearing noises the whole time. This music's getting to me. You going to be behind here? Oh, there we go. There we go. So is this where the engines and other shit were, I'm guessing? Oh, it's just... Hi, Caitlin. Dang it. There's two Caitlins here now. Oh, God. Dang it. <laughs> oh! Jesus! Whoa, 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 whoa! Oh crap, Marcus! Oh god. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, oh! Oh, damn. Can you get up, buddy? That was a bit, took a bit of a tumble there. Get your torch. Come on, man, you're good to go. There you go. You don't feel pain. Oh, it's the other androids. They're here. Say Jericho. Jericho, right? Welcome to Jericho. Here we go. That's where we are. Yeah. So what? It's like a gathering of all the androids. Met the people of Jericho. Ooh, yeah. All right. Well, honestly, considering how... Considering... Um, low the views are and everything. Um, I think I'm just going to stop this one here. The episode here. I'll pick it up some other time. I also got some other stuff I want to get done tonight. I just haven't had a chance to do anything because I've been so tired all friggin' day. Thank you for showing up, uh, Caitlin's. <laughs> you all have a good day.